In VA17, we've added the Steel Joist Institute's Virtual Joist Girder Shapes to our shape database. The Virtual Joist Girder Shapes allow you to reasonably approximate the weight and stiffness of open web steel joist girders in your FEA model by using wide flange bean shapes with manipulated section properties based on commonly available top and bottom cord angle sizes. Virtual joist girders are intended to be used in an FEA analysis as custom wide flange beams that are sized using steel design code checks. Once the members are sized, equivalent section properties can then be used to specify actual joist girder design requirements using conventional SJI joist girder nomenclature. Let's take a closer look at how to properly use virtual joist girder shapes in visual analysis. I've set up an example project to demonstrate how virtual joist girders can be used in a VA model. The model is a single level building 200 feet by 120 feet with joist girder moment frames resisting lateral loads in the global Z direction. The SJI virtual joist girder shapes are available in the shape database under the virtual joist and joist girder category and can be used just like any other member within visual analysis. Once you have the model set up, loaded, and have good analysis results, design the virtual joist girders by placing them in member design groups and optimizing the groups. After you have refined the design of the virtual joist girders, you can then create one or more report tables to assist you in specifying the design requirements for the actual joist girder necessary for the construction of the building using conventional SJI joist girder nomenclature. We hope the addition of the SJI virtual joist girder shapes to our shape database helps you in designing projects where the standard joist girder tables do not apply or for cases where you need to include the stiffness of these members in your FEA analysis. Give it a try and let us know what you think. Thanks for watching and enjoy your day.